Hey everybody, thank you for tuning in, watching this, whenever you are watching, if you're watching it live, thank you, if you're watching this replay, thank you so much, and please share, 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 share this out. I wanted to update everyone on the current Yellow Day situation, the fundraiser, the uh, thank you, everything that I, I need to do to all of you for, for everything you're doing. So let's start just with a reminder about the day. So May 9th, 2019 is Yellow Day this year. Uh, remember to visit makesomeonesdayyellow.com to see the full story on how this day started, why it started, what it is, what it's become. You can get all your information there. All right. Secondly, thank you, thank you, thank you for all the support of our t-shirt fundraisers. Now, I, I, I wish that we could keep this going and going and going because people have asked, but um, we had to end it so that shirts were delivered on time. Um, but please keep in mind that this day is not about the shirt, right? Th this was a fundraiser for a good cause, but we still want you to participate in Yellow Day as a school, as a family, as an organization, community, whatever it is, regardless of whether you've got the shirts. Um, it's not about the shirt. It's not about my book. It's about spreading kindness and the message that Honor left behind in her legacy that she has. So, but thank you. And, and here's what I wanted to update on the shirts. So the second round of the fundraiser that we ran for one week due to high demand ended last night. We sold another 109 shirts, I think it was, another $720 raised. So in total, for Team Megan Bug and her fundraiser at Lurie's Children's Hospital in Chicago, we raised $5,050 in t-shirt sales and donations. And, and that just blows my mind that you all uh, helped out with that. I mean, in, in t-shirts, in t-shirt sales, we raised over $5,000. So thank you all so much for helping support the cause, the need to help find a cure for pediatric cancer. And that's what Megan's mission is all about. So thank you all so much. We really, really, really appreciate it. So there's that. The other one is is a challenge and a push. And I'm sure, well, first of all, I, I, I guarantee that she probably doesn't even see this. So I say she's getting annoyed with me, but I doubt she really is. But we are on a mission this year to get Ellen DeGeneres and her staff to go yellow uh, and celebrate Yellow Day with us. As you all know, if you watch Ellen, you know that she's a big advocate of just kindness and being kind to one another. And we think that this mission, this legacy of honors that she left behind, this idea of Yellow Day in itself it is right up Ellen's alley. So we have been tagging her like crazy. Other people have been sharing things and tagging her like crazy, tagging Ellen to join us the show and Ellen Tube. Um, we want her staff, we want the Ellen Show to go yellow on May 9th. Uh, whether or not she sees this, whether or not it happens, I don't know, but it's worth a shot, right? So Ellen, if, if you happen to watch this, please, 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 Go yellow on May 9th. Visit makesomeonesdayyellow.com and, and check out the story. Uh, Honor is someone who, who would have loved you and I guarantee you would have loved her and her message of kindness and her, her idea for what this world should be. So everyone that's watching, let's share it as much as we can. Sorry if that annoys the people that check Ellen's social media, but we're trying, right? We're trying to get the message across. So um, thank you, Ellen. Uh, update. I think that's all I have for you today. Again, keep checking makesomeonesdayyellow.com for more information as we get closer. Teachers, if you're watching or even parents with kids at home, if you want some freebies, visit the website and click on the free resources. Some of my good friends have sent free resources to me that we have shared through the website and Teachers Pay Teachers. And um, just keep sharing. I do have to give a very, very special shout out again to the town of Chillicothe, Ohio, where their whole town is celebrating Yellow Day with window clings and garden flags and t-shirts and fundraisers. And um, I hope, fingers crossed, that I get a chance to visit that town uh, before or after Yellow Day and, and go thank them in person. We'll see, I don't know, we'll see if it'll happen. But I just had to update everyone, give a big, big shout out and a thank you to all of you who have supported the T-shirt fundraiser, supported Team Megan and her cause, supported the Yellow Day cause, who have already pledged with me by sending me a message saying that our whole school is going yellow on May 9th. Um, I'll be sharing information soon about how to uh, keep track throughout that day and share pictures and post pictures. Uh, but anything you're doing in advance, Make sure you share it, tag me at Teachers Learn Too, and tag the hashtag Make Someone's Day Yellow or Be the Yellow or both. And uh, we just want to see all the yellow that's being spread. And I hope that um, this year I can update that map with many, many, many more yellow tags to show you where Yellow Day has spread. But again, from the bottom of my heart, from everyone at Team Megan, on behalf of her and her fundraiser, uh, thank you for all you've done so far to help make Someone's Day Yellow and to help make Yellow Day what it's going to be for 2019. Thank you guys so much. Have a great day.